Well, the stars and the fans have arrived for the start of the biggest event in country music. And as you just saw there, <laughs> that was John Bon Jovi, whose new bar on Lower Broadway opened today. News 2's Stephanie Langston has been getting a first-hand look at all of the action on day one of the festivities. That's right, we just landed at Nissan Stadium where the doors officially open for night one of CMA Music Fest in about a half hour now, but it has already been a memorable day from country royalty Dolly kicking the morning off at Fanfare X over at Music City Center to rock royalty John Bon Jovi opening the doors to his new restaurant and bar on Broadway, JBJ's, known as the tallest building now on Lower Broad. The frontman for the Grammy Award winning band has roots that run deep here in Music City saying he finally has a place to call home. These are my people. You know, if you think of Hollywood as the actors community, Nashville as the musicians community, it seems wherever you go, there's another great writer, another great player, somebody aspiring to, con you know, have their own bar on Broadway someday. And I've been attracted to that for 35 years now. And you got a pretty good neighbor. I mean, Garth. Yeah, I know. I know. The new kids on the block aren't so bad, right? Yeah, two old vets next door to each other. It's going to, it'll liven up the place for a week or two. Now, the bar officially opened this afternoon, of course, just in time for CMA Fest. Back out live now, you can see that again, they are gearing up to open up the stadium for night one. And speaking of rock, Southern Rockers, Leonard Skinner will be headlining tonight. Also on the bill, Ashley McBride and Thomas Rhett. Of course, we're going to have all of your highlights for you right here on News 2 at 10. Reporting live from the stadium, Stephanie Langston, News 2.